Hello everyone, my name is Sutton Wolf, and welcome back to One Shot. I wanted to play more of this. I was gonna just do three episodes, because these episodes are kind of long, um, and they take a while to record, but uh, I want to play more of this, because I'm so curious. Alright. There's something weird about the robots who, just got, who get sent to work near the gas fields. They appear to accumulate, accumulate rust at a much slower rate than the others. The few who work directly with gas harvesting look practically new. Is that just a result of the atmosphere, or am I just seeing things? Alright, so that's telling me that the gas is part of the solvent that I need to use to get that robot better. Alright, um... So I need a funnel. I don't know where I can get a funnel. Let's see here. A lot of buildings out here. Oh, it's a factory. Hello, person. Welcome to the old chemical processing plant. Most of the equipment has already been relocated. Okay. Hmm. It seems to be a page ripped out of a book. Oh, right. Hmm. Okay. So this is what I was look this is what I had seen before. So I have the acidic gas. Hmm. Alright, so I need to find the blue phosphor. Without breaking the liquid seal, inject the liquid phosphor into the container. Inject the liquid phosphor. Further shaking is required. Alright. Okay. Hmm. I'm still trying to get over the fact that this game calls me by my, like, biological name. I wonder how it even, like, figured that out. Because, like, on a lot of my... On a lot of my, like, profiles and things, I just call myself Sutton. Because that's what I go by. But, like... Maybe my computer itself, I'm recognized as Kyle? I don't know. But... That's so weird. It, it's, it throws me off. Because, like, even in class and stuff, I go by Sutton a lot of the time. I usually leave it up to the teacher's discretion, though. Alright, so... I need a funnel. Empty syringe. No? Um, alright. So, I need phosphor. I need the blue phosphor. Where do I get that? Hello, small person. You're not much bigger than I am. Welcome to the lookout point. Below us is the old quarry. The head engineer lives a little more to the east. The entrance to the old old mines is, is further to the east. I see. Okay. Alright. So, I meant to get some of that blue phosphor, which is apparently made by the shrimp. But I don't know where I can get some. And that is still up there, and I don't know what that is. What is that? Can I... What can you do? I don't know what to do. Let me... Oh, where am I gonna go? I need to get some of this blue stuff, the rare phosphor. I don't know how to get it, though. And I still need a funnel. Let me travel the old factory. Okay. I need a funnel. Let me... Is there anything in here I can use? Nothing. A big metal box with complicated machinery inside. Alright. So I need to get a funnel. I need to get... There's that... Oh! You know what? Um... Where was that bubble of stuff I needed? Was that the phosphor? I don't think it was. It's that guy. Let me go... Check at the phosphor stuff. Have I been in here? 
picture of a robot. You know, I've never been around so many robots before, Kyle. Or any robots at all. I mean, I see them in cartoons and stuff, but I've never seen one in person. They're pretty neat, don't you think? Hey, Nico, do a robot voice. Yeah. Yeah. What? Try talking like a robot. Um. <clears throat> Beep boop. I'm a robot and I eat batteries instead of normal people food. <laughs> that is not correct. That is not correct. Robots do not consume batteries in the same way people consume food. In fact, robots do not possess digestive systems. Some robots do not even have mouths. Kyle, you made me look silly. Aw, oh, I didn't mean to do that, Nico! Hello! Hi! What are you doing up there? I am stationed here. By yourself? Yes. Aw, I didn't mean to make you look silly! I just wanted to have fun! I wanted you to have a good time! Oh, I'm so invested in this guy. Hello, organic person who is alive. Alright. Oh yeah, I was gonna go back to that one place. Alright. My goodness. What's down here? I get sidetracked so easily in this game. Oh, that person, that thing is still following me. Let's go over here, huh? Hmm. There was a... I know that there's like a little bubble over here. This fence is on the ground. All the others are taller than me. Alright, now where was that bubble of whatever it was? Hmm. Okay. This is so, like, weird. Is this where it was? Ah, here it is. This pond sure looks different. The water looks like jelly. It's formed a bubble over the surface of the pond. Syringe. So, we're filling up the syringe, Kyle? I guess it's kind of like a funnel. But the liquid might be a bit too thick to fit in the needle. Hey, it actually went in! Gross. Alright. Filled syringe, bottle of smoke. So, I should inject the liquid through the cork, right Kyle? It's like I'm a doctor. Oh, I should probably shake this too. It changed color. Okay, bottle of acid. Cool. Now I go back to the docks. And I use this on the robot, right? Correct? I'm reading that right, right? Whoop. Where's that robot? Down here, right? Yeah. Bottle of acid. I need something I can use to wash the robot with. I'm guessing you want me to pour this acid onto the sponge, Kyle? Good thing I have these gloves. I hope this works. Wet sponge. Alright, hold still. I have no other choice. There! How's that? I can move again. Thank you. I am able to fulfill my purpose again. Where would you like to go? Can you take me to the tower? Calculating. Closest destination to the tower is the Glen. Port number blank. My built-in navigation circuits have fried. I'm gonna assume that's not good. It is not good at all. Once again, I cannot follow my programming. Aw, oh, is there anything I can do to help? In the event of an error, you should speak with the head engineer. She will know what to do. Okay, I assume that's that lady at the outpost. Oh, wrong. Not outpost, lookout point. Excuse me again, miss. 
I found a robot who could take me towards the tower. But it's having some trouble, so it told me to talk to you. Alright. What is the issue? It, it said something about the navigation circuits being fried. Just the navigation circuits? Apparently. Kyle and I fixed everything else, I think. Hmm. I have something that may help. Robots have the ability to trace material from their source locations. If you let the robot borrow this, then its backup tracking system should activate. Ooh. Wait. That... That clover symbol, isn't that on that strange journal that we have? It's a very pretty necklace. What's it made of? Amber found from the glen. What's the thing inside the amber? The black clover? That's a common plant in our world. It's also... Uh, I'm not sure if I can bear to part with this. My programming says yes, but I still feel conflicted. Never mind. You need to finish your mission more than I need a keepsake. Here. Oh, oh thank you! Jeez, that music. Before I go, is there anything I can do in return? Actually, do you know how to play chess? Yeah, well, sort of. I've played it with some older kids before. Then, wait. Then, will you play a game with me? I mean, I don't know the rules very well, but I guess it's the least I could do. Oh, cool, we get to play chess. You're really good at this. Thank you. It was built into my code. Ah, so, what's it like, being a robot and all? I've talked to other robots, and they all say something about programming and code and stuff. Even you did just now. It's a little hard to understand sometimes. I know. Most of the robots here are not tamed. Tamed? Watch out. There goes my bishop. Taming is complicated. Oh? How complicated, exactly? There goes my other bishop. I can't really explain what tamed robots are. But I'm one of them. All the other tamed robots have been moved to other regions. Exactly where, I don't know. Oh? There goes my little horse. Knight. Right. Oh, have you ever been to any other regions? I heard that there are two more. In the past, yes. I still have the data, the coordinates, the memories. I don't know how much of that still holds true. The world may be a very different place now. Because the sun is gone? No. I said this already, didn't I? The sun probably won't save the world. The decaying started back before the sun went out. The sun's sudden death was just the tipping point, and things went south really fast after that. Oh. Then there's nothing I can do? Check. What? When did your queen get there? The only thing you can do is complete your pilgrimage. In a way, you're only supposed to be the second chance for the people. Just like how the Barons was only supposed to be a second chance for me. There's no guarantees that things will work out. But, checkmate. Alright, I guess I've kept you long enough. Thank you for listening. I hope you get home safely. Uh, thank you also. You're so nice. Why are you so nice to me? Do you have anything else? Off you go. There's no reason for you to linger in the Barrens. Alright, well... Alright, so I have... an amber. Strange journal. Okay, so that... You see that, right? The amber and the strange journal have that same... Kroger have that same, like, clover thing on them. Alright, whatever. Back to the docks. First... I wanna... I wanna check to see if I can sleep. I'm not sleepy anymore. Alright. Well, let's check out this... The Glen, then, I guess? Amber. Oh! This is Amber from the Glen. I can remember now. Activating tracking system. Setting course. Wait. This boat is over capacity. You'll need to leave behind some of your possessions. Oh. Well, I don't think I'll be needing this crowbar anymore. Or this gas mask and gloves. That is acceptable. Onwards we go. Okay, so I don't have the gas mask. Oh! That's so adorable! Oh my gosh! 
Oh my gosh, I want Nico to succeed so much. All right, what now? Here is your stop, the Glen. Thank you. There should be a village to the north, but that is all I can recall. Oh, that's good to know. Farewell. May your mission be a success. Uh, are you leaving? Yes, I must return to my station. But you'll be all alone again. It is okay. I have not been tamed. Oh, that whole tamed thing. The horizon is glowing blue. Oh, there's no music. It's kind of creepy. Alright, well, I guess I have to go in here. Alright, well, we got past the barons, at least. Ooh. Whoa. What is this place? It's so pretty. Huh. What in the world? Oh, what was that? Okay. These look like crab shells. Oh, what are you? I'm catching fireflies for mommy! You a person? Alright. Can I go in any of these buildings? I guess I can go in this one. Who are you? There was a time when our people. <clears throat> oh, I can't use that robot voice. <laughs> robot is voice anymore. There was a time when our people used to live in these ruins. But due, due to flooding, most of us have moved to less permanent settlements. Flooding? Aye, the land has gotten brittle. The glen used to be in one piece, you know? But now it's just a bunch of small I of islands that get smaller and smaller. Uh. The jar is full of fireflies. There's a bed over there. Am I allowed to sleep in the bed? It's a bed. Well, more like a mattress. Alright. Ooh, who are you? Hmm. Nothing's biting. Fishing people. I wonder what these people are. Like, what kind of things are. Ooh, what's up here? Oop. Whoa. Cute. The jar full of small rocks. Go in all of these places. Last week I saw more of those squares while out fishing. I knew better than to get too close, though. Squares? Square squares, man. They're bad news. Squares are bad news, duly noted. It's not something I thought I would have to note. Daddy says the world is very sick, but Kyle can make it better again. Are you Kyle? Uh, not really. I'm just the messiah they sent. I can talk with Kyle, though. Wow! What's that like? Really cool. Aw. Thanks, Nico. You're swell. I'm... Uh, I, I hope I'm not, like, wearing him out by running all the time. Slowly being chipped away already, but it's still trying to stay alive, I think. Doesn't matter. One day the world will finally give up on this fight. I just hope I'm not alive to see it. I'm bringing back the sun, though. That won't fix the root of the problem. Just like the other lady said. But don't lose heart. Without the sun, the world will die much faster. At the very least, I'm sure everyone would like to see the sun again. Well, that's fair. Looks like moss. I guess people eat those. Who are you? The land is fragmenting at an alarming rate. I don't like to think about the day when this town finally loses to the intruding sea. We'll have to find another place to settle. Like nomads? Wow! Is that the sun? Yeah! And you're holding it? Isn't it hot? Not really. It's nice and warm. Wow, there's so many houses. Whoa! This is it. The last of our grain surpluses. And now that we're dealing with a vermin problem. Maybe you can get cats? Not that I'm a cat, I mean. <laughs> That's cute. 
stay away from the squares, okay? Mm-hmm. What's up with the squares? Um... You're gonna get dizzy if you keep spinning around like that. I'm the tower! Huh? Grandpa says the tower used to spin all the time, bringing sunlight to the world. I want to see it too! Well, I'm here now. I guess it'll only be a matter of time again. I'm so full of hope. Ooh. Most of the green moss covering our village has already lost its glow. If it wasn't for the thin strip left on the boundaries of the land, people could easily fall into the ocean. Without light, land and water becomes indistinguishable here. Wow. Alright, what's up here? It's not ready yet, but would you like some stew? Uh, I'm not hungry, but thank you. It's the least I can offer. It's the least I can offer the savior. It's some kind of stew. Don't be afraid. <clears throat> I keep mixing up the, <laughs> the voices. Don't be afraid to ask if you want some stew. All right, well I can get some stew later. All right, now where am I meant to go here? I'm in a village of some sorts. I think I've reached every house. Oh, that's cute. <laughs> They're like little sheeps. Oh, are you a shepherd? Hello. Hmm. I need someone to help herd my rams. Oh, I can do that. I've seen some grown-ups do it back home. You kind of just push them around. Hmm. But you are carrying the sun. Uh, wait. Can you just watch the sun for me? I cannot. I am but a simple shepherd. Um, okay. Come back when your hands are free. You'll be rewarded if you can herd my rams. Alright. The crops have been growing poorly without the sun, and there's no telling how long our surpluses will last. Please, Savory, you have to hurry. I, I'll i do my best. Oh my gosh, there's so much pressure on this kid. Alright. Um. Oh, what the? It's a wagon stuffed with stuff. Sure is. Hey, uh, you here to trade? Trade? Yeah. Is there anything you want to get rid of? Make me an offer, and I'll give you something in return. Hmm. Do we have something like that, Kyle? What a strange journal. Wait, trade this? Don't you want to find out what it says first, Kyle? What's that? A book? Uh, not sure if I want to take books. I can't read. All right, I don't want to give that. Not giving a light bulb, holy cow. Amber. I'm not gonna give that up. That's like precious to the person. What's in here? The doorway's full of vines, Kyle. Hmm. Alright. I need to find some kind of place where I can sleep, I imagine. What's up there? Whoa, what the heck? This looks like an altar. Some kind of cloak or shawl, folded neatly. A pair of shoes and some jewelry. It's an orb. The material looks like amber. There's a, it's a staff. Reminds me of the one that Robot from the Barons was holding. All right. What if I put the light bulb on here? No. No. What if I put this on it? No? Okay. Hmm. Curious indeed. Can I go around here? Oh, what are you doing? The flood can take away our farmlands, but it can't take away our fish. Good. Good to see people can actually eat. Um. Uh, I want to try and... Whoa, that's a lot of shiny things. Glass shards, glass marbles, empty glass bottles, mostly empty glass bottles, glass bottles filled with different things, bits of string, colored wool, plain wool, fabric scraps, a rusty bucket, scrap metal, shells, some rocks. What's all this for, by the way? I just think they're neat. Okay. I don't want to trade this. What if I had something to trade? What do I... What would I trade? It's a firefly jar. Um, Alright. Let me see here. 
Oh, can I go down there? Well, a lot of exploration that, that has to be done in this game, you guys. The light from these lanterns will have to do for now. I'm starting to see some very small sprouts. It'll probably take some time to, for these to bear fruit. Uh, okay, I'm not going to step on their crops. That'd be a dick move. Alright, um... What can I... Oh, there's a side entrance here. Can I not enter that? Okay. Guess not. What am I to do? I don't want to, apparently. Um... What am I meant to trade? I don't want to trade the amber. Is that a sentimental value to that person? I might see them again someday, right? What am I meant to... Oh, how do I get in there? Oh, that's the find off place. Can I go down here? No? All right, I'm kind of lost. Hmm. Eh. Hello. Oh, I already seen this. So it appears that this game, like, it's obviously a puzzle game, um, but it's like the kind of puzzle game where you, it kind of just like sets you in the world and you have to figure out what all the things mean, and I like that. Wow. Blocking the path. Hmm. All right. I really like that system, by the way. I like the the whole it being a puzzle game and but like it it doesn't like tell you the rules or anything it's like it it you're just in the world and you don't know what to do i quite like that it gives the game like that intrigue oh, that's the stew guy i really just have no clue here guys let me look back down here hmm what's over here I think I already went in here. Do you still live here? Sort of. Fish populations near the village are thinning, so we fisher folk are mainly making temporary shelter here. Makes sense. The deep, the deeper ruins have been abandoned for a while, though. But I do see some kids coming in and out of those. I think they actually live there? Ancient ruins. What? Oh, let me go down here. Haven't been down here yet. What the? Alula. Alula, where did you go? Kyle, did you hear that? Alula! I think it's coming from southeast of here. Whoa, creepy trees. Hey, you there. Have you seen a little girl? She's a little bit shorter than you, and... Wait, that's the sun. Are you our savior? I... Yeah? Oh, my stars! Sorry for my rudeness. Uh, it's all right. Are you looking for someone? My little sister. She's been gone for three days now. I've been looking all over, but what does she look? What does she look like? Um, a little shorter than you. Long blue hair. Two blue feathers on top of her head. I'm sorry. I haven't seen anyone like that. Where was the last place you saw her? Back inside the ruins. She said she was heading towards the forest, so I'm waiting here now. I ran out of places to look. Alright, so I want to find that person's sister. Weird little square of water. Southeast. What's this? The sun. You're the messiah. Are you on your way to the tower? Mm-hmm. You can enter the refuge through this wall. You'll need to sign your name on this scroll first. Alright, do you have a pen? Um... 
No, I've lost mine. Perhaps you should look around the glen for another. Alright. So I assume this is sort of like the ending area? Ooh, what's this? Whoa, what are you? Hello, peasant. Please do note that the ruins below are partially flooded. Oh, should we not be here? There is no immediate danger. Using this area as a dwelling is not recommended, however. Alright, so these are the ruins, right? Alright, well I think that's a decent enough area to leave off at, guys. On the next episode, we'll have to go down to the ruins and see what we can find. I love this, guys. This is getting cool. Um, I really, really, really like what they're doing with the... Um, with the... I guess the... I'll, I'll say the story. Like, the... I'm so... They've done such a good job of making me curious. Like, I'm so... I just... I want to know what's going on. And I love it. I love a lot of things about this game. I love the characters. I love... Like, the, the the way it's set up, where you have to, like, go and find everything, and it's so mysterious. I love the images and the art that they did. I love the style, like, the sprites. Oh, my gosh. I love Nico. I want Nico to be okay. I don't want anything bad to happen to Nico. But, regardless, that's going to do it for this episode, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Leave a like, comment, subscribe to the channel if you can. All this stuff really does help me out as a YouTuber. And I will see you next time on One Shot.